<clears throat> Welcome back to The Basis for Truth. Interesting. Let's hear it. With so many conflicting views regarding the afterlife, is it even possible to know for certain what happens when we die? The simple answer for those still living is no. Science has been unable to give us an objective answer so far. <laughs> you mean they haven't given you the answer you want? <laughs> it's been quite objective and apparently objectionable to some. Is the truth offends some people, or at least the pursuit of it. <sighs> you don't need to pursue anything if you're already arrived, you know, in Sunday school. Okay. That's why this magazine offers the Bible perspective about death and the afterlife. Looking forward to it. And you'll be amazed at what you think the Bible says about these subjects versus what it actually says. Yeah, I've noticed that too. A while ago. A long time ago. Welcome to the club. If you ever cross that scary threshold into objective thinking. And this is a cause for rejoicing. Eh, it is what it is. Knowing the truth about death can take away the anxiety and provide you with a picture of hope and assurance like nothing else can. Eh, I don't know. I've almost died several times, actually. I can tell stories. Maybe I will someday. But, uh, yeah, it no, wasn't like that. Trippy. And all, but here I am, you know, and I'm still seeking out answers. Anyway. It can also help you better deal with the grief of losing a member or friend. It's great if anything else can. You know, it worked for me. A good friend died uh, not too long ago. And... I couldn't shake this depression because it was just a damn cheat that this person isn't around it, that entity that was him, you know, that personality, you know, and I wouldn't saw dumb and dumber too. And laughed until I cried and that cleared the clouds. So thank you, uh, Mr. Carey and Mr. Daniels and all the, the Farleys and all those. That worked for me, but you know, I have always been kind of different. <sighs> I mean, it, it doesn't make it go away, but it, it put the fire part out and allowed me to start healing. So, thank you, Dumb and Dumber, too. It's worth the discovery, and we're happy you're making the journey with us. That's the end of uh, the introductory uh, part. So, what happens when you die is coming up next. <coughs> anyway, we will dive in right after this. <laughs> 